This video is about the text top. So if you look at the parameters page, um, at the first tab you got this text tab and there are a lot of options but I will only cover the basics. So first things first, I'll make it a bit bigger so that you could actually read it. So um, in the text field you can obviously set text hello friends and there is a nice little feature um, that's called post text so I could insert this great and whatever I type here pizza is great derivative is great and they're really great so they could be doubled and now we see that the text hides behind um, the canvas. So there is a um, toggle called word wrap and if you switch it on it will just make a line break. So let's remove this for a second and stick to this. So the next tab covers um, the font. You can load, there is a lot of options from files um, that are installed on your computer. If you want to use custom fonts, um, like um, I made some Korean stuff um, shortly, um, you could also load custom fonts and um, see how it's not working. <laughs> so. Um, yep. Okay, I just um, made um, yeah capital letters available in this font file. So yeah, that's how I make um, yeah my custom fonts. So let's go back to the derivative is great thing. Um, yeah, the next is you can make text bold and italic, um, whatever. You can set the font size, and yeah, it's um, per default set to point, but you could also um, set it to pixels or to to fraction, and um, where you can make it much, much, much larger, and it will crash your computer if you make it too large. So let's reverse it and hope that my computer recovers. Yeah, it works. And you could make some basic kerning, line spacing, um, alignment, whatever you like. Um, the next part is yeah, font color, which is pretty obvious. Um, yeah, in the comment tab you can set uh, the resolution. So yeah, this is all you need to know about the desktop.